tell us about Canada. <laughs> Adam, <laughs> tell right, us about Canada. Where, where you want <laughs> you're, to getting, you're getting filmed, by the way. Right on. Okay, so start off in the west. You got BC. Mm-hmm. Um, lots of evergreens, really lush forests. Um, hippies, you go up, you've got mines, lots of mines up here, mm. and then flatlands. Um, in this, all the Northwest Territories, a lot of this is lakes and tundra and flat and cold, and it gets to like minus 40, minus 45 with wind all over here. Like, it's mm. really cold, and this is where you see uh, the Northern Lights. Aurora Borealis. Oh. So you want to go up to the Yukon. You want to go up to Yellowknife. Great lakes here to go camping. You, in the winter, you can go kick skiing, where you're just on a sled and you kick across a lake. Uh, yeah. Um, anyway, so very cold. Mm. Um, green, um, healthy, outdoorsy hippies. So this is here. Yeah. So how many, how many, like, how many people live in these towns here? Ah, uh, it depends. Mm. Up north, it's really spread out. Mm. Very few, no? so very few people, only very few people live here. Very few, yeah. Very few. So the, where's the, mm. there's oil here, is there, or down here in Alberta? Um, It's mainly in Alberta. Okay. Yeah. And then... So, so the so Athabasca has a huge pipeline, but that's really bad because it was leaking into yeah, a no. really big... I oh, know, it's crazy. ...watershed. It's crazy. Um, and then you got Saskatchewan? Flat prairies... Yeah. Wheat mill, farmlands. And then Manitoba? Um, still pretty, pretty fair. Well, well, uh, these three places are so-called prairie region. Is it prairie? Pra prairie, yeah, prairie, prairie yes, yes, yes. What's yeah. the meaning of prairie? It's a... Uh, flat? Ah, prairies flat. are just flat. Uh, just mm. flat. Uh, yeah. Uh, so, I don't know, what, what, what would be the, the linguist definition? Prairie is in you prayer. Prayer meaning that you could maybe see to the horizon and you could see where you're going, maybe. Or you pray for rain to come. No, it's, it's spelled differently. How's it spelled? Uh, P-R-A-I. P-R-A-I. Prairie. R-I. And to pray is with a Y. So it's like almost like a pear. P P R. It's just a, a, a prairie. A prairie is a flat expanse. It's flat a flat, expanse. flat land. Mm. Yeah. And then Manitoba is flat as well. Is is similar enough? I don't I don't know much about Manitoba. Like there's not there's some solid solid. Where are you lakes, from originally? You're Frenchy, aren't you? Yeah, I'm in, I'm from Montreal. He's no he's, Montreal. He's French. Wow, yeah. crazy, isn't it? Dirty French. Mm. Yeah. We do some things well. <laughs> it's just some things. Yeah. Not switch though. All in good time. <laughs> yeah, Montreal people are uh, speak many. French, but Quebec, Quebec speak French. Quebec is French, so French. Montreal so, or also the so French. So Canada has French and English mm. as the national languages. Mm. Um, Quebec is a French province. Mm. New Brunswick is bilingual. That's New Brunswick down here. So yeah. It's not even on here. Fredericton, New Brunswick. It's right there. Oh. So this this little one right there was that... Moncton and Fredericton. And Prince Edward is the one with the bridge, isn't it? Yeah. 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 The island. So so Quebec is French. Uh, New Brunswick is is legally French and English mm. as their provincial languages. So it's bilingual, and all the other provinces in Canada are English. What's uh, La Labrador? Labrador is kind of part of. Um, what do they do up there? Nothing really. It's all it's all fisheries and stuff around, right? So this is like huge fisheries. Like your like main industry here would be fisheries. Um yeah, but they're also talking <clears throat> about uh, doing doing cargo crossing already through here, which is really really dangerous mm. because it's so uh, it's but so treacherous. They would also fuck the ice caps as well. Yeah, they would. But the problem is that there's. Such a such a huge possibility of the ice caps fucking the tankers, that the oil tankers would just have massive leaks and destroy uh, huge ecosystems. Mm. When will we get rid of oil? No time soon. We can do it already with the current technology. Yeah, but the problem is switching off is like. Not really. We can do it, it. No, but 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 to do that straight away yeah. would be kind of the equivalent of mid-flight asking a pilot to turn off. The engines of a plane and glide to the landing. I can do that. Not over an ocean. There you go. 